Ooh, hello there, my fellow Scar Squad members. Good times with Scar here, and welcome back to Astoneer, episode two of our Let's Play of Good Times here. And we've got to name this planet. I want you guys to help me come up with a cool name for this planet here as we are awaiting the sunrise. So in our last episode, we were totally inundated by a storm. So we took shelter in our space toilet and that looks like a really cool palm tree over there. Kind of got distracted. Anyway, let's jump out of the space toilet and we are back. All right. So this that's my backpack. Is that my backpack? It's totally my backpack, isn't it? Wait, can I just? Can I just put this back? Do I do I need new backpacks every time I get out of space toilet? Uh, I guess so. Where were we? So what we needed to work on in our last episode, I believe, was to create a smelter, and I wanted to create a 3D printer, and we needed a couple more things to create those. Those. So what we've got is we've got quite a bit of resin in our inventory, but what we need is compound. We've got some oxygen, we've got some copper ore, and I believe if I'm going to shoot over here real quick. Um, let me take a look at my inventory one more time. I believe we actually had some aluminum. Now we have copper, but it is ore. Oh, wrong button. Still haven't learned. Um, yeah, okay. I think we're good. What I'm going to check real quick before we head off is if we can make these. Yes, we can. Perfect, 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 perfect. So we're just going to make some of those real quick. So those, of course, are our tethers, and we are off. So, my friends, we're back on our adventures. So I'm going to go this way, and we're going to head off. And like I said, we're looking for some compound because it seems like all of life is all about compounding. And we're going to take a look around here, looking for those little white balls again. Those are kind of our key to success. Now, this is my resin field. Um, I kind of destroyed the field. <laughs> this is where I fall in holes all the time. And uh, if we had a jetpack, it would make life so much easier. And this is a plea to the developers. My friends, my friends, I don't know if you think I'm your friend, but I think you're my friend because I love your game. We need a jetpack. That's right, we need a jetpack. If we had a jetpack, life would just be the best. I mean, life is just would not be the same with a jetpack. We would be cruising around, avoiding falling in holes, and there's some white stuff up here ahead, I believe, and I'm getting excited. Oh no, that's oxygen. Darn it, I was hoping for the, I was hoping for the compound. So we're gonna put that down. Ah, I need some compound, what is this? Hello, oh, I need my space gun, there it is. What is this? Ah, oxygen. Well, mm, let's see, how much do we want of it? I guess we could take a little oxygen, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, let me take a look at my inventory. Yeah, that's okay, that's cool. Uh, we might need it for something, um, you know, breathing, stuff like that. <laughs> we might need it for a little later. Um, so we'll, we'll keep that on hand, just in case. Looks like I'm caught on a rock. So like I said, keep a weather eye open for any signs, any signs of a compound. Rats. Found some resin, but I still haven't found any compound yet. We've come to the end of our tether. <laughs> we don't have any more uh, compound to create any tethers, so we're totally going rogue at the moment. Look at this beautiful landscape. Absolutely incredible. And I love our pumpkin man suit from the space shuttle. Oh, oh, oh I thought I saw something. Is that resin? No, oh, I thought that was, what is that actually? Oh no, that's my pointer. <laughs> oh, there it is, there it is, I saw it, I saw it. It's straight ahead, it's straight ahead. All right, we gotta conserve our oxygen, we don't wanna get too crazy. Um, there it is, let's pull out our space gun and let's start compounding. <laughs> let's start compounding, that is all we need. We've got our compound for all your compounding needs. Oh, this is great. This is good stuff right here. We're gonna get all the good stuff. The best stuff's down here, that's right. It's not all weathered by the rain and the wind. That's right, get that all up in here. Get this, oh, hello. Oh, geez, we're just bouncing compound all over the place. Now question, do these despawn? Because I mean, they're in their little like canister. See these little canisters that the balls are all attached to now? I mean, it seems like maybe it wouldn't, but uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna get rid of some resin and I'm already thinking of ideas for this game and I'm like barely know anything about it still. Um, but I, I, want a, I want a friend, I want a friend, I want a robot friend. So I'm gonna point that out to the developers that I would like a friend. I want a robot friend, he follows me around. I mean, he doesn't have to be named Wally, but uh, it could be something like that, you know, like a little creature, just a little, a little friendly creature like Wally or something. He follows me around, like maybe he could store some of my material walks next to me. Think of that Boston Dynamics uh, robot. That's what I want. <laughs> okay, I'm looking around here. Uh, tether. Oh, Tether, where are you? Oh, sweet, there we go, this way, this way. Oh, there's my tethers. 
Can we make it? Can we make it? Can we? Yes. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. Awesome. We're back. It's always good to feel that pure oxygen that flows through the tether. So there's that beacon thing that we might need to make. Even though that there's that little like uh, blue thing that shines over our space toilet, I'm considering making that beacon just in case because I don't want to go adventuring and lose my space toilet. That wouldn't be a thing. That would be a bad thing, actually. Home sweet home, my friends. I can't wait to make this thing a little bit more uh, lived in, if you will. Maybe we could build up some things with the train tools. Maybe we could even make a little house. Um, can we turn the house like into an actual like shelter? Maybe. All right, so first thing, what do we need to do? So that's the printer, that's the smelter. Um, this needs, this needs compound. Let's do this one first. Okay, I've got you what you need. Please cooperate for once. Cooperate. <gasps> Is it working? Oh my gosh. Look how beautiful that is. Awesome. There we go. Sweet. All right, let's put that away. Um, how are we doing here? How are we doing, 3D printer? Oh, by the way, there's an amazing uh, documentary on Netflix about 3D printers. Highly recommend a watch. Good watch right there. Scar approved. Um, okay. Oh, it needs power. Hey, we have this little powery thingy. Let's put the power thingy right here. Power thingy there. Nope, 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 no, the power thingy just is like, no, I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> power thing doesn't want to do it there. What if I move the train down a little bit? All right, let's try that one more time. <laughs> He's like, no, don't make me do it. Don't make me do it. No, nope, nope, he won't do it. Okay, so now we need power. Let's check this thing real quick over here. Uh, what does this need again? So this needs refined Copper. See, these are little squares, whereas our copper is... Oh, see, this is aluminum. This looks like it's been refined, whereas this set over here, maybe it is. I don't know. What am I doing wrong in this case? Let's try it one more time. Oh, yeah. See? See, it's totally not into it. Totally not into it. Okay, that's fine. It doesn't have to be. Um, so let's go back over here, and this needs power. So, looks like, my friends, we're going to be off to look for power. So... Let's drop off our supplies. I think we have quite a bit of resin that I would like to keep uh, from going bad. So we're going to put that right there. Looking good. So that's a bit of compound. Here's my resin. Um, I'm just going to store it here. Oh, no, it doesn't want to get stored there. Oh, shoot. I'm out of resource spots. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave this off. I'm going to keep this on me just in case. I'm going to keep this on me. Yeah, I'm going to keep that on me. I'm going to keep... I'm going to drop that off too. Then I'm going to make some new tethers. There we go, got some tethers going, so we'll get those into our inventory. All right, beautiful. And I'm gonna go back to the Snorlax cave, and I'm gonna see about going in there because I bet there's some power in there. I just got the power feeling. You get the power feeling sometimes? Got the power feeling. Um, oh, let's check this one more time and just see if there's anything of use here. Oh, no, wrong button. <laughs> Someday I'm gonna learn. Oh, we got power! Oh, sweet. I was checking to see if our if our little beehive over here had any more power, and it totally does. Super happy about that. But now we don't have to go off on any adventures, even though, I'll admit, kind of wanted to go on an adventure, but that's okay. Oh, look at it, look at it, look at it. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, I wonder if we can put solar panels on this. I bet we totally can. All right, is it gonna do something? <laughs> I'm totally ready for it to do something. I was kind of open for like fireworks, but that's okay. Um. Oh, you want to go up here now, don't you? <laughs> now you do. I'm going to take you off just because you were being rude earlier. Um, let's see. What do you do? Put that up there. Woo, oxygen. Um, okay, that didn't do anything. Kind of anticlimactic. Uh, let's see. Uh, what's this thing? Okay, this is the copper. I mean, I've got the copper. I got the copper. And you just you just won't take it, will you? You just you just can't do what you're, you're told to do. So what we need to do is we need to take that ore and put it into... Oh, oh, scar fail. Just another one of those scar fails. This is where it's supposed to go, right there. Oh, I think this is it. <laughs> I totally think this is it. This, see, I thought I, this was the printer. See, that's my problem. See, I thought that was the printer. Turns out it's not. So, how do I make this work? Yeah, smelter. Woo, great. Smelters. Wow, smelter time. How do you work the smelter? Smelter, I command you to work. <laughs> oh, there it goes. It just needed a little bit more power. There we go. Look at it. Oh, that is so cool. Look at the animation going up there. Oh, but we're out of power. 
Oh no, we have a little power left in this section. So we got a, a couple little things. All right, it, this is totally, totally gonna be not enough. I'm sure of it. So let's put that down and let's grab our last set right here and let's set it into the printer. All right, how are we doing? Oh, there it goes. Oh, that is really awesome. We did it. Oh, that is totally cool. So problems here, right off the bat, we've got some power issues. So we need to work on power. So power, power, power. How shall we bring power and light to the world? So I hope you guys are thinking about what this world should be called because I'm leaving that up to you guys. Um, what's this? Is this just hanging out? Hmm. See, there's a little bit of power hanging out right there. You see that? Kind of want that, but it's not going to give it to me, is it? All right, let's go check the beehive and see if there's any more power we can extract from the bees. Please, you need to get the bees over here again and start extracting it. All right, anything left here? Oh, we got a little left. Is that just, just one square? Just one square? Is all you can spare is just one square? It's all you can spare is one square. Ah, how rude. How rude. Person's in need and all you can spare is a square? That's fine. That's fine. All right, let's jump over here and let's just add that to the tally here. I'll put that right there. Okay, how are we doing? I'm seeing it. It's working. This reminds me of Price is Right games. <laughs> Does this remind you of Price is Right? Uh, the good Price is Right. Okay, what do we got? Solar panel, storage. Uh, what was that? Wind turbine. Oh, I like that. Uh, battery, uh, generator, a uh, one seat. Oh, oh my gosh. That is what we're working towards. We're working towards that vehicle, and it's going to be amazing. All right, uh, let's see. Let's do this. Let's do a solar panel. Let's try it out. All right, it's taking the compound. It's using up all the power. I will point that out. I hope we have enough. Come on, have enough. Yes, we have enough. Okay, so let's th let's see if we can like hook this up. Hey, look, it worked. Oh, that is so cool. Perfect, perfect. Let's do one more solar panel. Oh, no, I don't think we have enough. Let's check over here and let's put this on there. And what's that? That's resin. I need compound. Boy, I need to set up like a mine or something to find enough compound. I think I might have some in my inventory. Let me double check. Oh, no, that, that's tethers. All right. Where was that compound we found again? Ah, uh, we are back to our compounded fields. Hey, I forgot we left some of that. Oh, no, that's resin. I got more resin than I know what to do with. So I'm not even going to deal with that. So let's get all of that beautiful compound. Oh, looks like we found another hole. Don't fall in the holes, <laughs> Scar. Don't fall in the holes. That is our goals, not to fall in the holes. All right, let's get as much as this we can. And I may or may not have seen some uh, shiny yellow stuff, which of course isn't gold, it's not butter, it's not even cheese, unfortunately. It is power, and I think we may have found some down here. So I'm gonna double check. Yes, perfect, that's power. All right, uh, let's get the last bits of this. There we go, ooh, ooh, 50%. Let me just jog back over here real quick. There we go, get some of that clean, pure oxygen fill in my lungs. Make me feel all invigorated. Um, okay, all right, that's good. Let's grab this. Nice. Oh, jeez. Oh, remember when we talked about the jetpack? <laughs> remember when we talked about the jetpack? I love this game. I've had a smile on my face the minute I've turned this game on. And uh, I can't say that for every game. Not that I don't disenjoy it, but uh, um, this game has just been an absolute pleasure so far. I've been playing it for probably about two hours so far and just loving it, just hitting record and just letting it all flow, and I, I really, really enjoy this game so far. And uh, like I said before, let me know if you guys are playing it yet. I feel like this is gonna be a game that evolves, and uh, I really do hope that's a thing. Um, I really hope the d developers, and I think they are uh, committed to making a cool game and seeing how it, seeing the long haul of it. And uh, for the most part, since I've been playing this, have we encountered a single bug? There's the one time we kinda got stuck but then we got like bounced right out of it. Oh, we're gonna die, we're gonna die. Oh my gosh, we're gonna die. Oh, there it is, there's that oxygen. Let it flow, let it flow. There we go, feeling it. <laughs> there we go. Um, okay, let's check our inventory, let's see how we're doing. Let's see, we got some organics. Truly don't know what I'm gonna do with those, so I'm just gonna leave them behind. Um, got a little power, would like a little more power than that. Got a few of those left. Got a lot of compound. That's good, oh geez, wrong button. <laughs> uh, when am I gonna learn? Um, I think we got everything. Let's pull out our space gun one more time. Just check and just check. Oh, there's a little more compound. Don't want to leave any behind. Don't want to leave anything behind. I'm sorry to the residents of this planet. Uh, I left the hole here. 
<laughs> My bad. <laughs> All right, we are back. And I was thinking about this. I wonder if maybe eventually we could even grow farms. And I think the number one thing just looking out what I love for this game, animals, some type of creatures attacking would be just like the coolest thing ever. So yeah, let's get back to work here. So I think what we we're gonna look for was another solar panel if we could. Um, the only issue I think with our power is that uh, nighttime is an issue with our solar panels. So we could do a wind turbine, but you never know, you know, that's, it's not every minute that it's gonna be blowing wind, of course, and it's not every minute the sun's gonna be out. So it's definitely a concern, but I think as long as at least we have something powering, you know, it's a wind turbine, it's a solar panel, like it could be whatever. Uh, let me just jump in here and I'm going to grab out my set of that, set that right there. And I'm going to grab out one more. I need that to move. Thank you. And I'll put that right there and a boom and a biome. And there we roll. Look at it go. I love it. Just that power situation is disturbing me. Um, but it looks like we're doing OK. So grab this. Come on. Let's check here. So we have three. It looks like we have three stacks. OK, that's fine. Uh, let's jump back over here and see if we even have room for this. Let's set that down here. Come on. Come on, little fella. Come on. There you go. Right there. Ah, oh, it's not wanting to attach. Hmm. That's interesting. I thought this would attach there and then be able to, like a power source. Because it did it on the other side. I wonder why it's not wanting to attach now. Maybe because it's nighttime? Ah, oh, I'm going to set this to the side a minute. And let's jump over here real quick. I think we have enough. Let's pull out one more set. I can't see around you. <laughs> I can't see around the, the, the backpack. It's it's kind of large. Um, hmm, still getting used to this, um, so still struggling. <laughs> All right, let's, what's this want to do? Really wants to put that aluminum in there. Oh, there it goes. Okay, anyway, I think that's fine. Oh, no, no, you, you go back over here. There you go. Uh, oh, maybe I could like turn it on? Ha, ah, wait, wait, now it has like a giant like pad under here. Hmm. Is there a way to connect it via like wiring? Anyway, um, I just like, I, this isn't so much fun. The reason is, is I don't know how to play the game. And I feel like this just brings me back to like before, uh, before now, like I, I would always like research the heck out of a game before I wanted to play it. So, but I don't know. I'm just having fun just figuring it out. I don't know about you guys, but I just find that just super fun. And I haven't done that enough lately. All right. Um, I'm just struggling here with the solar panels, as you can see. Let me figure this out after I spend some time in my space toilet. All right. That feels better. All right. So we are back on our way. Had a little rest in our space toilet there. And whoa, that that's a big moon right there. That's a big one. OK, so my thoughts are that the solar panels might be for the buggy. And I don't know if that's true or not. Oh no, they're turning on. So turns out I was wrong as I was contemplating on the space toilet. So that's a thing. All right, so we're all powered back up. Um, so can this one get attached to this guy over here now? Nah, nah, see, it just it's not about that. It's not about that. It will not be a part. So I'm gonna throw this in my inventory real quick. I'm gonna try, oh no, there it goes. It just needs both pedestals. Okay, we are a learning as we go and I love it every minute of it. Okay, so let's jump back over here and see if there's anything else we can make with all of our resin as we're here. Let's see, storage. That's exactly what we need. <laughs> exactly. That is all we need, really. Solar panel, you need to pick up the pace here a little bit. <laughs> you need to pick up the pace. Okay, now what do we do with this now? Can I just drop it? Does it need to be attached to anything? I'm just going to say I can drop it. And it's going to live right there. And it's going to be super happy with life. Nice, nice, that's really cool. Oh, perfect. And then we can take like our aluminum and set that right there. And let's see, how much compounding do we have inside of our kit here? Let's just say we throw in a kit right there. Let's put this, I guess we'll set this on the other side. There we go, put that right there. And let's take this, I'm gonna set that right there. Um, let's make some more torches, just in case. Not torches, those are tethers. <laughs> okay, awesome. Wow, I'm super happy about that. Look at that, we got a little storage unit all set up. And then these uh, panels are working out, so I'm happy about that. What other things do we have on this list? Okay, wind turbine, the battery. Oh, so we can power it at night, but I need the lithium. So we need to go on a lithium adventure. So the generator, okay, one seat, <laughs> yes. Um, okay, that's awesome, all right. Oh, yep, wrong button. Oh, yep, oh geez, yep. okay, anyway. 
Let's go back over here and see if there's anything we can do with this at the moment. Uh, smelt, oh, no, no, I need you right here, thank you. Uh, smelt, no, no, I really just need the smelter. Let's see, smelter. All right, if I click the smelter, it pulls up that, so that's the thing. Um, okay, so that's good. Let me grab out some compound, and I wanna see if there's anything else we can make with this little thing that sticks out right here. Remember this thing? All right, let's just see what it does. Let's try it one more time. Oh, it needs resin, not compound. So compound is a primary component to the 3D printer. Okay, okay, all right, I'm learning this. I am, I'm truly learning as we go along, and uh, I think we're, I think we're getting the grasp of this. Really do think we're getting the grasp of this. I'm really happy about it. So, all right, resin, I've got what you need. Make things happen. All right, you need more resin. So where's my resin field? I think, if I'm not mistaken, it was over this way. Um, let's check the beehive real quick and see if we got anything. Beehive, hello. Thank you very much. Very much. Oh, whoa. Wow, you're very generous today. Um, is that resin? No, that, that's compound. So compound is the circle white balls and the resin is those like inner tubes. Okay, I'll remember that now. <laughs> I remember that now, but I wish I would have known that compound was so close to our base where we kept like exploring like great distances to find it. And it turns out it was like in our backyard. <laughs> it was in the backyard the whole time, that whole time. Okay, awesome. All right, let's see where else, oh, jump up there, awesome, okay. Uh, let's take a little look around here. So I'm just trying to see if I can, hello, you look sad. <laughs> I will take you with me. There you go. Um, I was hoping to find some quick resin, but I seem to have lost it. Next thing I would like for the game is signs, like directional signs, like, hey, the resin fields are right here. Um, hmm, where did the resin go? I think it's just on the other side of here. I think we just went the wrong way. I didn't realize that the ground had changed around our base. That's kind of cool. Let's see, anywhere else I can find resin. <laughs> I just want to do like one more thing at that. Oh, here it is. Here's the resin. Awesome. You tried to get away from me. Tried to get away from me. But I found you. I found you. And I'll always find you. There we go. Grab that all out of there. Got that out. Oh, geez. Wow. That was a thing. Uh, oh, just a little bit more down there, a little bit more, and let's grab some right here. We're gonna have to build a bridge right here. <laughs> We're gonna have to build a little bridge because I'm not sure we can get by that anymore. Okay, let's get back. Oh, shoot, we dropped a canister. Um, That's okay, that's fine. Let's go back and see what we can do. Now I can actually run because we're on the tether line. All right, let's see where we left off. Ah, oh, right here, right here. So let's add the rest here. Um, let's see, let's grab out our last bits of rest. Sometimes you can grab it off the back of your backpack without actually accessing it, and then sometimes you can't. Um, I guess, we'll see about it. Okay, awesome, so we have another little bay here. So what I'm kind of hoping for is we turn this into a vehicle bay. So I kinda wanna create this as a vehicle bay, and I think that'll be super, super awesome. I'm gonna grab that last piece of resin, and there we go, my friends. That is episode two of our Astoneer Let's Play. And I do hope you guys have enjoyed this as much as I have so far. Look at the beautiful green shining onto the clouds, looking ever so wonderful. So what we need to work on our next episode, of course, is our vehicle base. So somehow, somehow or another, we've got to figure out how to make that. And uh, let's put our resin and our supplies from our adventure onto our storage unit. And I wish you guys an excellent and wonderful day. And until next time, this has been Good Times with Scar, and we'll see you in the next episode.